What you know about badness? Mash up the front room, whole heap of madness. Whole nother villa for the female gangsters. Not no idiots, bare high rankers. All day sipping, it's wine and champers. Send a wave like ships and anchors. Money making, no broke ass bitches. Bad be business, straight to bankers. Come along if you wanna try it, man. Might get hit with a frying pan. And if you don't understand, bits get hit with flying hands. Mash up the kitchen and bathroom too. Real talk, this not what baddies do. Not gonna lie, if I were you, wouldn't be able to stand your face. We run the club. What's in madness? This is our show, yeah, 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 if you with me say yeah. What's poppin'? My name is Lani Good and welcome to Bad Is UK, The Correctional Retreat, Season 1. I'm a bad B, they stay looking but these brothers can't have me, they call me Lani Good Good, but I'm a bad B, running up the bounce, broke bridges can't catch me, they call me Lani Good Good, but I'm naughty, big front, big back on the show. Now, if you don't know, my name is Lani Good. I'm an influencer and I'm a graphic designer. That's my nine to five, baby. I work non-stop. Bitches are mad. Bitches are mad that I'm making the first show about baddies in the UK. Bitches are mad because they can't afford it. But it had to be me. I'm the sacrificial lamb. I won 20K on big TV on a show called Tempting Fortune. And that's why I've got the funds to do this. Now, grab some popcorn, grab a beer, sit back and relax, because this is going to be the ride of your life. OMG, baby. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to Badders UK Correctional Retreat. I'm your official host, Emil Morgan, and this is where the good girls that become bad become bad girls gone good. Say he want to lick it like an ice cream. Say he want to lick it until ice cream. He said, them the biggest titties that I've seen, yeah. Titties on your tongue like a First of all, I have to just say this. If there's going to be anyone hosting this show, it would have to be big. Listen, ah, it would have to be a more Morgan, okay? Who else is qualified? Look at the material, darling. What's up? I would have had to host this show. Me now ask Christ, the darling outside. All right. <laughs> Talk to me nice. The baddest boy had to be here to host the baddest show. All right. <laughs> The Correctional Retreat is a meticulously crafted experience with the aim of providing young women who have been labelled delinquents, having either transgressed the law or found themselves marginalised in society, a nurturing environment where they can either acquire skills to control their anger, find solace and experience emotional healing. The ultimate aspiration is for these young women to return home as reformed individuals. But of course, we'll find out whether the retreat worked or not by the end of this journey. What do you guys at home think will happen? First of all, the mix-up dollies that's watching this show is not going to understand all that jargon that you just put. Listen, babe, <laughs> let's dial it back. Let me show you how to do voice of a good girl. Let's not make this overcomplicated. This show is about the bad guys come to mash up the dollies them in the house if they try them. That's the routine. Like, let's talk about what you really got people here for because you're happy right now. Safe it. Yo, um, I'm C, the big one, not the little one. Magnum sipper, pum pum liquor. And yeah, man, we outside. Real nitty gritty. Catch me in real life more than TV, though. Yeah, I had to jump on it and remix, but really this is the G mix. Put your glasses on and C mix every time I jump on stage. Them have to pull it up and wheel it. Hey guys, it's Rainbow TV RDRD, the number one star in Willit. Yeah, you already know I'm an artist. I'm the baddest, biggest girl on, on the net. No cap. The plane is good vibes, you know. <clears throat> cool, we got off the plane, yeah. I'm seeing Policia in Croatia, innit? I don't know who she is. I've never seen her in my whole 22 years of life. But she just started again. Lippy, I'm thinking, sorry, in my head, I'm thinking, is that a boy or a girl? Do you understand what I mean? She just starts piping up to Lani. And I'm thinking, bro, where's this place? Like, where has Lani brought me? Like, who are these people on the show? Stop calling my name, bro, because I didn't do nothing wrong. So stop trying to make out like I did something to this guy. 
You're gonna upset me too, man. Yeah, but you're not going in this car though. Bro, I don't care where I'm going. Tell me where I'm going and I'll go. But right now, I'm really not in the mood. Like, I'm really not in the mood because I didn't do nothing to the man. He put his hands in me and I can't blam it in his face. Because I'm more in Croatia. No, but you were being rude. No, I wasn't being rude. I just said to him. Was I being rude? I let she's me telling me saying to someone. Bro, me saying, bro. Yeah, me saying to someone. It happened right now, right here, and I'm still upset. So you're not gonna tell me that I'm not allowed to be upset. upset. He, I explained to him very nicely that we're not from here. We just got here. Just explain to us that you're not allowed alcohol in public, innit? And, and I put it in Rainbow's Doll's bag. Then man, I put his hands on me. I pushed me. You saw, you don't saw that with your own eyes, bro. So don't come to me trying to tell me about something. It's nothing. But I said, more. Can I say something? 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 Can I I can't personally believe that this girl's just come here and she's going on like this already. No, this is mad. First of all, what did I get myself into? What exactly am I hosting at this stage? Because I don't think I can manage. This is mad. Like, first of all, we literally just touched down in the people's Croatia and she's already breaking more with the police here. This is too much. Nah. <laughs> you guys have to understand that the way she's behaving, this whole show could have been locked off. She acting erratic just because the man touched her, pushed her, whatever she wants to say, is erratic. Between you and me and everyone else watching, I have a strike system. And this is C's first strike. Because at the end of the day, what you're not gonna do is put my show at risk. While I'm standing by the car, I just heard bare commotion. I've turned around and C's just <laughs> In, in Lani's face. Stop me. Hey, you trying to say, oh, did it, is she playing? And I said, bro, I'm not involved. The whole time I was sitting with Cookie and a day shot came over. You said, what are you doing standing up? I said, there's a free seat now for city. He was all chopping up. Whatever was chopping around, I don't know, I don't care. And that's what I was explaining to the flight attendant. I'm not involved. He came to me and said to me, give me the bottle. He man took one look at, you know how it feels that people always look at you and make, I'm like, you're the perpetrator because of how I look. Do you know how that feels, man? You don't know how that feels because you're, you're a nice, soft girl. People always look at me and I'm the one that takes the blame. I wasn't even involved. I understand that, bro. I weren't involved. Don't put it on me and don't put it on me. I never said that. Because I thought it was going to be like influences like myself. Do you get, I never thought it was going to be like random boys. The police officer touched C like, in like in a way to guide her to come to a way where she's not shouting because my girl's shouting like do you know who I am? Da -da -da -da. I'm just looking at her like bro you come to Croatia with a do bag are you dumb? Who is this girl bro? But yeah she's been piping up to the police the police has touched her she's like he's touched me he's touched I'm like yo what kind of girl is the lady? country and the thing is it's all on my dime can't you pat yourself for me bro because you know me i came over to the guy you pat yourself for another hour of course i'm passing, but I, came I, passing but I came over to these lot and that's when i got upset and started being upset to them that's it i'm not allowed to come to we're all cool the police are there and you're being loud well because i'm talking i cool i hear what you're saying i understand what you're saying a man has just put his hands on me and i can't hit him back then I have 11 brothers, four sisters, and I'm the youngest. Do you think um, the whole man, and because of his, his status and his power, but I, wouldn't I can't do, I hear that, that, but I wouldn't do this to you. If, if, I can't, I can't hear him if, if you, if you, If you had brought me on something that you had invested in, and someone pissed me off, and I knew you could fuck up your shit, I would have patterned my behavior. If a man, if a man just yeah. put his hands if on someone, you, if someone, Lani, if that's a lie, then you're lying to me, but that's a lie, I don't want to hear it. Because if anyone puts their hands on you, Lani, and you, and you're not able to... If it was fast, if it was on your dime. Lani, you're not thinking about the bigger, you're not thinking about the bigger picture. Let's calm down, let's calm down, let's calm down and get to the places. Because I'm the one who's been trying to tell everyone to calm down for you because I am your friend. How come you're not calm down? Because a man just puts his hands on me. I understand that. I'm scared of being shot. So, the racism in Croatia, it's a bit dark because remember, they can't really speak too much English and they end everything with the shia. So with the police shia, and the police and the emergency yeah, it was too much CS for me. So you see with the police in Croatia, the fact that people's already fighting them and things like that, I was scared because if they bring the SWAT team, I'm gone. Lani, there's no control in these bitches. That's why you made this show, is it not? Like you brought bitches you can't control. I'm talking to the police. I've got Google Translator. They're telling me I need to go get my friend. They want a sorry. You're not getting a sorry. 
Like, seriously, from these girls, you think you're gonna get a sorry? So, see, thankfully enough, like, I don't know this girl from Adam, but she's clearly got some sort of simmer in her because she went over and she apologised through her teeth. What? These girls, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, when you go on holiday, you don't fight with police. Why these lots moving rats here? I'm standing here for fucking 10 minutes. Are you dumb? Do you know who I am? Everybody raps like them, but not everybody raps like me. They think I'm copying a Giolo, Mr. Fab or IVD. Let's not forget, you shoot my scene. I can't forget it did help me. How, how do you think I was balancing figures at the age of 19? Huh, Ray knows my name. Huh, huh, Adi's my name. Let, let, let's be real, you girls start fighting influencers to be saying, hey. Yes. What the fuck? Are these girls? How many people are there? Rain doll. Oh, she's just noise. Like Rain doll is just noise. That's all I can say. She's irritating. Yeah, from the time we got into the house, I was looking for my room, found my room, she chatting shit. No one's getting a room before me. No one's getting a room before me. Who the fuck do you think you are? Who the fuck do you think you are, Raindoll? Like, seriously, come out the house. You're not even a baddie. You're not a baddie. I'm not being funny. I've never heard of you in my life. I'd be real. I, I don't know you. Never heard of you. Is your name Rachel, Radam? What's your... I don't know who the fuck you are. I don't care who the fuck you are. You ain't nobody. You should actually be sleeping on the sofa because you're nasty. So, <clears throat> obviously, we're getting to the villa now and everyone's looking at me like, they want to pick their room first. I'm not going to lie, I've scanned around the building. I'm basically the biggest one there. I've worked hard to have this, like to be in this position. Do you understand what I mean? So when I get big things like Valentino and Birdie and different people telling me that they're going to have their room first, I'm looking like, are you guys buzzing? Do you get I love Essay so much, but I remember asking her, who said you can have that room? Because really and truly, I get to pick first. For Rage and Dawn to turn around and talk about how, oh, um, she has more followers than all of us and who are we? Bitch, who are you? Because as far as I know, you're just a scammer from Twitter that people are looking for. There's people in Afghanistan looking for you. You scam people for their money for apartments and leave them stranded. So when you want to talk about influencing, the only thing that you're influencing is stealing and scamming. You owe people money, you got to sit this one out. And then on top of that, you pay for your following on social media because it's the engagement and the following for me, it ain't equivalent and it's not matching up. So you got to sit this one out as well. Okay, so I'm not going to lie, my first impressions, I was scared on my way here because the houses were a bit whack. Then we got, we pulled up to here and we literally all screamed because it bumped as hell. But the rooms, I think there's like three or two people in each room. I don't know what's going on with that, but I locked myself in the room while everyone was running around screaming about rooms. That's what you call smart thinking. Now I'm in the room by myself. Yeah, that way. Yeah. It's the bad guy section. Follow me. This okay, I'll open it. Oh good. So this is our lobby area. We have our sister's room over here, bad girl birdie, we're and outside. we're not Emile. Right, we're outside and we just reach, and it's been a habit with them girl over there in the rooms. Crazy. We're outside and we'll find a room. Right, come in the room, come in the room. We get there. The tag off me, we quick, we have to <laughs> look how we get about. Yes. <laughs> look on the right. right, right. I, I haven't shown you guys the best bit. Right, show Follow them. Follow me, come downstairs. No, wait, you need to show them the best bit. Oh, right. Right. No, that's the second best bit. Right. You haven't seen the pure lemon juice yet. Pure lemon juice. What? What? When I say it's pure pepper prawn, skelly and salmi, I gotta get it wrong here. What? what? The fridge is empty right now, but we're gonna fill it. Ready? Come. Come on, buddy. Yes. Let's show them the rest of the empty room. Okay. The real OG. Show you the guys top. the doms. Show you guys the best bit. Yeah. 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 As for me, we've got our sauna here. Oh. Over there. No, everyone's already taken it. Take it. Take it. Where are you? 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 Where are you?
Oh, Are you dumb? Carla, if I can't find the room, if I can't find the room, I'm saying. Wait, hold on, though. How the hell can these. No, no. Apart from the girls that I like here, how the hell can these other girls find their rooms before me? So a figure comes in the night and she's like, shh, don't tell anyone. It's Tamara, isn't it? She gives me a key. She says, don't tell anyone. You can have your own room. And then she tells me again, the way you're acting and that, um, I've seen it before. And obviously I'm burst off my head. But I'm thinking, what is this girl talking about? Obviously, thank you for the key, but what's she talking about? She's like, my son has autism. I think you have autism. I'm like, in my head, is this girl dumb? But obviously she's like, you know when we're coming back to London, do you want to go to appointments together? I'm thinking, yeah, 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 but just give me the key. Like, what? girls in this villa are too in a, how the hell do you think you know me for me to be, nothing's wrong with autism, but how do you think I have aut autism just because I'm lit in the villa? Like, really? I think she generally has something wrong with her and she needs to get checked. That's fact. And me and her had a personal conversation on the plane, but she admitted this. She said that being in an African household, that they don't, they don't allow anything to be wrong with their kids. They will tell you go to church. They will tell you go and pray. They will tell you you're fine, but these times you need help. So Randall is shouting at everybody, questioning people. She's definitely under the influence of something. I don't know what's of. I'm telling you, this girl's a bissard, fam. I'm telling you right now, her eyes are all popping out of her head. I think this dumb girl has brought in, yeah, Shoving it all in a dusty, stinking ass pussy from that mum's lap. So, Rainbow, we all know you like a bit of this. <laughs> so, I thought I'd bring some for you. You're sat there going, Kelsey, come. Do you want some? Uh, do I want some of this? <laughs> do I look like a crackhead to you? These drugs ain't good for your brain, baby girl. Your pupils were popping out of your head. You look like you was having some mad seizure. I may be crazy. But I also brought you these. These are antipsychotics. And I think you need to start a full prescription because something ain't right in there with you. Me, my name's Meta, you get me? I'm from SE28, where if you know, you know. You get me? And respectfully, if you sent any of your baby mums or your girl into this villa, Hey, real boy, you done a school boy error, my kid. Baby, and she loud and wicked. Fuck the tool, let's go swimming. Big weak arms, I might just go fill it. Pivot, right? So trust you won't miss him. And hell, these lungs are gonna fill it. Bang, really thought it was silly. Barber, cut the V's, I'm gonna trim it. Wish this, sorry, I'm taking your missing. Baby, and she loud and wicked. Fuck the talk, let's go swimming. Big weak arms, I might just go fill it. Pivot, right? So trust you won't miss him. And hell, these lungs are gonna fill it. Because everyone's gonna think I'm fake, bro. I'm not a fake person. Do you understand what I mean? Like, what the fuck? They're not gonna think you're fake. They're gonna think you're chilling. I'll be real. No phone, chilling. Is what it is. If people wanna say what they gotta say, then let them say what they gotta say. Do you get? And if they're your real friends, then they're gonna understand that. Do you know what I mean? Your real friends ain't gonna think you're fake because they know you're real. You know what I mean? From not replying to them. Yeah, because they know you're here. They were never your friends in the first place. Do you get Because if they were your friends, they know you for you. We don't know you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, no, we don't know you. You think it's even when I smoked a zoo, right? I'm so calm, bro. No, that's cool. We're going to have a zoo in a minute anyway. Bill it up. It's getting built now as we speak. But, they are. Literally. Like, your friends, cause they no. come and go in life as well. Yeah, like, you're here. You're here to enjoy yourself and you're here to get your rep up and then promote yeah. your music and that. Just think about you, think about your character, think about how you want to be perceived and, like on the camera. Think about you as a person. Don't take anything to heart. Literally, just be here YOLO. Literally, low YOLO it. 
Because you're only, you you're only here, you. like you're only here once. This is a one-time op opportunity. When it comes to Raindoll, Raindoll is acting weird about giving me her phone. She's saying no, and I don't know why she thinks she can have her phone. If this was Channel Four, if this was BBC, she would have been given her blood clot phone five minutes ago. The, the minute they said, f the minute they said, f she would have been handing her phone over. She would have no disrespect. I don't understand why Rando is making it difficult for me. And her behavior and the way she's acting is making the other girls have a lack of respect for me. So for me, I'll be real with you. As much as I love Rando, this is strike one. Do not ever in your life ask me about my rules. My rules are there for a reason. I'm the one who's been on TV. None of, no other bitch in this house has been on mainstream TV like me. I didn't make that rule up because of my ego. I made that rule up because it is a real rule about filming. It makes filming more efficient. Next time on Badders UK, the correctional retreat. Hey guys. Hey. Okay, so we're playing a game of the baddest bitch and the weakest link. You've got five minutes to decide who's the baddest bitch of the house and who's the weakest link of the house. I'm thinking, what a dirty bitch, bro. I'm saying it now. If you don't, <laughs> if you don't like it, you know what we have to do. Go, oh, go. Oh, let me get out of here. Please, what you know about badness? Mash up the front room, whole keep a madness. Hold of the villa for the female gangsters. Not no idiots, bare hat rankers. Both say sipping is wine and champers. Send a wave like ships and anchors. Money making, no broke ass bitches. Bad beat business, straight to bankers. Come along if you wanna try it, man. Might get hit with a frying pan. And if you don't understand, this get hit it with flying hands. Mash up the kitchen and bath too. Real talk, this not what baddies do. Not gonna lie, if I were you, wouldn't be able to do it. We from the club. Hi guys, thank you for watching episode one. Unfortunately, due to YouTube's strict rules and regulations, some of the baddest content is a bit too spicy, a bit too raunchy, a bit too raw for this platform. It goes against the regulations and their rules. Therefore, we had to make an alternative uh, platform for you guys to enjoy the content please click below in the description box and visit our website it is baddersuk.com that is baddersuk.com b-a-d-d-e-r-z uk.com and enjoy the rest of the show some content will be posted on youtube if it's suitable but the real raw stuff that's for our website